The School of Arts has been the location for large community meetings over a long period of time, but perhaps the largest and most contentious meeting ever held in the building concerned rabbits. In 1975, a Brisbane-based company, Thumper Industries, purchased a property on the southern edges of town with the intent of establishing a multi-million dollar enterprise to raise and slaughter rabbits. There was overwhelming community support for the project because so many jobs were on offer. A parade down the main street was held and the town rallied a huge community meeting at the School of Arts. A petition in favour of the project garnered more than 3,000 signatures. It even made question time in the Queensland Parliament. But it was all in vain. The Minister of Agriculture refused all entreaties to approve and facilitate the project on the basis that rabbits were a noxious animal and keeping them in captivity was prohibited by law. The fight was over, but animosity lingered in town for quite some time afterwards. Stage Lighting Stage lighting was pretty ordinary until the 2000 redevelopment. There were no footlights. We made our own, utilising batten holders tacked through electric cable laid across the stage with cut-out prune tins as reflectors. When Council's electrical engineer saw our lighting arrangements, he absolutely blew a fuse, as it were and dramatically banned our primitive efforts. On reflection, it remains a wonder why someone was not electrocuted. Sometime later, a lighting dimmer was installed. It was a large rectangular metal box, almost chest high, situated on the southern side of the stage. The stage manager, using beautiful black knobs on the dimmer, was able to bring a new level of creative lighting to productions. For the first time, lights could be lowered in intensity or different parts of the stage could be highlighted. However, its best use, though, was as a heating unit. It was wonderful on cold nights on the drafty stage and doubled as an excellent pie warmer. The Quota Club of Tenterfield's first a Stedford was staged in 1981. Competitions were held in speech, drama, debating, vocal and instrumental genres. The AD Donnelly Hall was used for speech, drama and debating, while the vocal and instrumental portions of the a Stedford were held in the main hall. At the conclusion of the first Estedford, the vocal and instrumental adjudicator, Mr Frank Taranto, suggested that if the Estedford was to continue, the purchase of a grand piano was essential. Subsequently, the ladies of the Quota Club, in conjunction with Tenerfield Shire Council, organised a public appeal to purchase a beautiful black Yamaha conservatory piano. Support from the local community was immediately forthcoming and the piano was purchased. The piano was presented by Mrs Nell Summerlad, President of Quota. Mr Kegger McCowan, the Shire Council President, accepted the gift on behalf of the people of Tenterfield. The wonderful quality of the piano encourages visiting musicians to give public performances. It is still in use today.